Good morning, everyone. Today is a very exciting day because today is our official day of moving to the new house. And the goal is to pack everything up today so that we could sleep there tonight. And I'm really excited because the bed is nice, the house feels nice. And I think we've already started to mentally separate ourselves from here. So this place actually doesn't even feel like home anymore. This place kind of just feels like this big hotel room that we're just currently staying at. Come here, kids. Me little fun breaky, go pee pee. Good girl. This is where they always pee all the time. We have a balcony with a patch of grass. Meatloaf, fun. Where are you guys at? Meatloaf, fun. Go pee pee. Where are you guys? God damn it. You guys gotta go pee. I hear you. I hear you. There you are. Oh, you guys are thirsty. But after you guys drink, you have to go pee pee, okay? Yeah, you guys are crazy thirsty. After you go, after you drink, you have to go pee pee. Good boy, meatloaf. Oh, hey, buddy. Go, go pee pee. Everyone go pee pee. Okay, you guys aren't gonna go pee pee, but the door's gonna be left open, so if you guys have to go pee pee, just go use it. Okay? Oh, good job, honey. So, yeah, that's the goal for today. And also, I think uh, we're gonna drop them off at um, the dog groomers just because the house is brand new and they're kind of stinky so we're gonna get them washed and smell nice and good so all of us can move into our new house and it's gonna be really cuny and oh someone is doing something someone is a little bit uh, someone's doing something yeah I'm in the bathroom don't come in here okay so uh, Ma Bear's in the bathroom. I'll show you her feet. No, 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 no! Why, 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 why? See? She's why? on. Okay. She's I'm taking gonna, a shower. I'm gonna start closing. <laughs> She's taking a shower for I'm sure. Gonna, I'm gonna start closing the door. One of the first things I'm gonna do today is wash uh, these brand new sheets that we got for the new house. Because I really hate. Ugh, there's something about new sheets and that chemically smell and it doesn't smell like home like it hasn't been used so I'm washing all this stuff all these pillowcases going in throwing these guys in and I just found some random like I guess high quality sheets because it's uh, our forever home but uh, I'm not that good at picking out sheets so when Marbert saw this design she thought it was ugly as fuck so she might buy new ones but at least we have a backup backup pair just throwing these guys in right now and I found this pack of four of towels just for us to use for now but uh, eventually I think um, Ma Bear is gonna pick ones that actually match and actually look good and coordinate together like a real home home you know like you ever been to like a nice Airbnb, Airbnb home where everything kind of goes together it doesn't look like a ragtag home because that's how my house was growing up because um, my mom's Chinese and we didn't have all the money in the world. So she was just buying stuff based off of what was cheap and for survival. And uh, we didn't have the luxury of picking out dope shit. But now I do, motherfucker. So I'm gonna invite my mom over so she could have a nice, happy experience. Oh, damn, this is soft. They weren't lying about Egyptian cotton. Ooh, wee, damn. That's soft, man. Oh, that's real soft. Oh, shit. Oh, damn, that's real soft. What the fuck? Ma Bear! What? From cleaning the house, I found uh, one of Briggy's old vomit areas. Gross! Where? It's fossilized. Ew! It's been there for centuries. Gross! Well, a few months, because we haven't lived here for a year. But look, look at the ground right here next to the mirror. Ah, it looks like that area is burnt. It's There's been no there more. forever. It does look crystallized and fossilized. Look at what we're uncovering. That's disgusting. Well, let me know how you clean it up. No! <laughs> I'm Briggy! Briggy, clean it up! Why are you guys throwing up in the most random areas? 
I know all your secrets, you little shits. You can't be looking at me all cute like that, son of a bitch. God damn it. So Papa Bear left to take the pup pups to go get uh, groomed and washed, as you guys know. And he also took a few boxes with him to make the first drop off at a new place. Um, I don't mean to be annoying about our new place, but we have a new place and I'm pretty excited about this new place. Eee! But while he's gone, I'm not chilling. I'm still packing and stuff. Our house definitely looks a mess right now. But I promise you, I am doing work right now. I, I swear to you, I swear. Like, we're clearing up a lot of stuff. Yes! Oh no, Baba Bear! All right, he's fucked a little bit because he's got to pack this. Oh no! These are all empty. Yeah. Oh, Baba Bear! <laughs> Fucking up! Well, I wasn't in charge of those. Oh, I don't want to forget those. <sighs> That guy we probably have to throw away. Don't know what to do with him. Um, empty, giving that out. Empty. Bunch of boxes that are going. Gotta just clean this place out. Should be good to go, I think. Not too much more left. I think um, once I could put away the little knickknack petty wax, um, we should be good to go. My sister's actually on her way now so that she could pick up some items because Instead of me throwing it away or whatever, I'm just kind of donating it to whoever needs it. So, slowly but surely, it's happening. It's happening. It's happening. What else? Yeah, like, this room's kind of empty-ish. It's ready to rock and roll. Still nothing in here. Same. Bathroom, pretty empty. We just gotta empty out our closet, which is pretty easy. We're just gonna... Pick up the hangers, take clothes on hangers, and just transport it from one closet to the other. Nothing too complicated. But yeah, I'm gonna continue packing before my sister gets here. I dropped off the dogs and I pretty much brought all the boxes here. We have a crap ton. At first, since, um, since we thought we were gonna get all new, brand new stuff, we're like, oh, we don't need a moving company. Cause it's just gonna be whatever's in the cabinets and we thought it was only gonna be like five boxes and then we end up having 20 boxes and now i'm like fuck i did all that work maybe we should have hired a moving company because we still uh underestimated the job there's still boxes in here too but what i'm the most excited about is this bad boy right here so i'm a big big sound guy ever since really no, but like, I'm like, I'm, I put money where my sound is. Me too. You do? Yeah, I even got all my cars. That's the one thing that I have to make sure that I get. I have to get a really good sounding system on it. So whatever model car I get, I have to make sure I get at least the, not top of the line, but the line that like, the that sound is. That includes the premium sound? It has to have good sound. Fine. You know this. Fine. I'm going to get a 10. <laughs> what? We still got work to do, babe. What in the world? I miss the sun so much. I know, but we got I never work get to do. Look how pasty I am. I know, babe. We have. You see all those boxes in the garage? We have work to I do. do. I do. I packed them all. I'm gonna yeah. get sun too. Okay. Isn't it nice? Oh, it is pretty nice. Our little backyard. But no moving is getting done right now. I'm fine. When uh, do we have it? Listen, listen, listen. It's so quiet. 
There's no dogs, no babies. That's all gonna change. I know. It does feel really nice out here though. I love like, all I can hear is an airplane and birds. This is a pretty big difference from our LA place. <gasps> Huge difference. It's slow. And there's plants. And there's green. There's life. The dogs love that little patch of green that we have. Yeah. Oh, did we bring the doggy bags? Because I think there's dog shit on that side, right? Oh, there is. Oh, but I think we brought trash bags. Oh, sorry. But anyways, back to my home. Uh, See you later. No, no, back to my home theater system. I'm really excited because I love sound. Every single car I ever had, I put a sound system in ever since I was in high school. So as soon as I saved up like two, 300 bucks, put a sound system in that motherfucker. So I love, love, love sound. I'm a musician. Same, 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 ears, same. Ears are my shit. Me too, but and, he does uh, not when it comes to talking. You have mad gap ears. I do have mad gap ears, but I could hear sounds like a motherfucker. Same. And so I was really excited to put together like a, a legit, legit home theater system. And uh, I'm not too big into surround sound because you could just never make it feel like a movie theater. But... Unless you get it professionally installed. Yes, but then that's a fuck ton. That's hella guap. That's like 50 we ain't got that Gs. Guap. That's like 50 Gs in your living room. Fine, well, I don't got that guap. But what we do have is I, I uh, calculated and did a little budgeting and uh, I got two floor standing speakers and a subwoofer and a pretty high power receiver and uh, I think this will go over there, that speaker will go over there and then the couch will be over here because it's all about positioning when it comes to sound. There's a lot of people that buy surround sound and it's useless because they're putting it in all the wrong areas and it's not hitting the most favorable position. This is called sound imaging. If you're into sound, you'll know about RMS wattage, you'll know about sound imaging, you'll know about impedance and all that other stuff. And this is all, all these terms, all these terms I learned in high school because I was hell into sound. So I already, already forgot. Not impotence, it's like impedance. I don't know the proper way. No, it's about like, it's about a uh, homage. Homage? No, ohms. Like how many ohms? Like, I'm not talking to you. You're, you're not helping out. You're just out there. She's just out there freaking enjoying herself. But uh, yeah, there's all these sound things. And uh, I forgot what I was saying, but it's hella technical. The cool thing is, so, huh? I knew those terms in high school. I forgot a lot of that shit, but now I'm just really happy I could watch movies like full blast in my face. And I'm gonna invite all my friends over. We're gonna have movie nights and watch scary movies and scare the crap out of ourselves. So that's what I'm excited for. But I gotta start moving all these boxes. Upstairs. <laughs> I should have hired a moving company. <laughs> I'm an athlete, babe. Babe. I'm an athlete. I know. Let's see that five, six hundred deadlift. Go. Uh, pick it up and then walk it. Do you think Usain Bolt walks or you think he drives? He runs. Exactly. He's an athlete. Yeah. He so runs he runs for the field. He trains for the field. But that's his... But if, from point A to point B, he's running. Yeah, but that's his job. That's his profession. Exactly. Yours, your job is to be the husband. My job... And how you become no, a good husband my is going to the job, gym. My job... My job... Is husband. to watch TV. No, everyone knows the husbands do the husband stuff, which is move boxes from downstairs to upstairs. I should have hired a moving company. I forgot I messed up today. You did. I know, I'm tired now. Me too. But what if we just leave everything in the boxes? But work still has to be done, so you gotta do it. I'm glad you're getting a 10. That's what wives do. <laughs> How did you end up getting here? I thought you were getting a tan. You were, <laughs> you were laying here and I laid next to you because I have a tummy cramp. Where did you get that pillow from? <laughs> you ordered them. You are freaking luxurious. You're out there getting a tan, and all of a sudden you're laying down. We gotta Can you move. My feet? God damn it, we got, <laughs> babe! We gotta freaking move. Mm, yes. I'm just kidding. 
Wait, we gotta get up, we gotta move, we can't be messing around like fine, this. Fine, 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 I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. This bed does look comfy though. I can't wait to unwrap it tonight and then put our sheets on it. Ooh, <laughs> I can't wait till you unwrap it also. Ooh. <laughs> oh. Hey, hey, you're a freaking mother, you can't be doing stuff like that. <laughs> Despicable. I am a motherfucker actually. Yeah? I'm putting my own stuff in my closet. This is the first time. I what was, is that? I was folding my sweaters and sweats. Yeah. And I was like, holy shit, I'm officially moving in. You look like a crazy woman up there. Ah. I want to see. Ah. Your phone's ringing. Huh? Your phone's ringing. What, huh? Yeah, you hear it downstairs? That's your phone. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I'm taking it out of the box and I've officially started moving in. Oh, shit. So I've decided for us that I'm going to take this and this. Okay. Um, Why, you don't think I could reach all the way up there? <laughs> no. Fine. And then you'll take this side because you'll probably take that side. Okay. So you can have this so it makes sense. And I'll take this since most of my stuff will be here anyway. Okay, so I get this side too? Yeah, I don't know because I'm kind of like left with just one and like a half, so I might need half of this. But that one you have is crazy long. It is? Okay. That's the long, long. remember that dresser couldn't fit here? Oh, okay. So it's really long. Okay, maybe that's all I need. Maybe yeah. I don't have as much clothes as I think I do. Okay. Yeah. So you have that entire side and then this side. But you're missing the point, Papa Bear. You're missing the point. I got the point. You're scaring me. No, don't say that. The cutie point. That. Okay, fine. The CUNY point is we've officially moved in. Like, like we've like when you have stuff in a box, it's like cool. We're in the process of, but once you start opening the box yeah. and moving it out of the box and finding a spot for it, like a little home. Yeah. Then it's like. Tell me about that little home. Then you put your little sweaters up there. Yeah. Well, for now, I don't know where else I would put it, but I was like. Oh. I moved in. That's so true. Cause now it's our stuff mm -hmm. with the house, and there's a marriage. Like, bing. Yeah, we just fucked. Oh shit. Yeah, we're making a baby. Do you want to remove this? I could take this off. This dowel. Um, maybe. Oh shit. I might be able to use it though. Like hang little things on there. Yeah, maybe. Make that fatty wax? Yeah, I, I'll just leave it for now, just as options. Maybe I could even put like uh, necklaces or something. I don't know, like accessories. Okay. Try to make we can also paint it white too if you want it to be more flush. Yeah, seamless. True. That's all I bugged you for. Fine. Thank you for coming. It's a monumental moment. It's the first. Uh, this is our house, so this is the first time I've put anything here. Because everything else, even the bed, since the bed outside, um, it's since, not ours. Yeah, since the bed outside isn't ours yet, like we bought it, we chose it but we haven't put our juices into it, so it's technically not ours, still brand new. It still doesn't feel like the marriage happening, like watching Mom Bear put her clothes in. Yeah, no. That is awesome. That's the real deal. You know what I'm even happier for, though? Uh, happier for the sound system. No, that you're not getting a tan or relaxing on the bed. You're actually unpacking. Come on. They're not believing you. Little snikes. God damn, what's that? What? Stop. Fine. <laughs> That's what you get. You nah, get I didn't do anything. Nah, you don't know. Yes. Oh, babe, can I get this top drawer? Why? Uh. Cause you know how I have like all of my gel stuff and like my. Okay, fine, fine. You can have it. You can have it. That's the shared one. The one on. Oh, we don't have that much cabinets. Like not all the drawers, like the other one. Well, actually, you said this is your side, right? Which side did you want? That one. Then you could take this, and I'll just take the medicine cabinet. Because I have a medicine cabinet, too. No, but we have medicine, babe. Let me just organize it. Just back off. Get out. Move it up. Move it up. Beep. 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 Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, no.
Yeah, it feels good in here. Yay, Best Buy is here. They're here to install the washer and dryer that I bought last time in the other vlog. Again. Oh, why are you guys giving me a hard time? I'm just I kidding. Just You're making so a baby. Much. You're making a baby. I know. I impact a lot. I'm just kidding. All those boxes you were filled before. I'm just kidding, Mama. Okay, I want fine. you to see the wash and dryer is done. Yay! Is that what you're gonna be using? What do you mean? Just kidding. Dun, da, da, da. Oh. Oh, what happened? Your puny hips? Yeah. They did a good job. They installed it. They're running it right now, so it's on. Okay. But. I hope you're happy with the choice I made with the washer and dryer. Ooh! Dun, da, da, da. This is so fancy! Have you heard of Maytag? Yeah! Wow, look at this, there's like no buttons. Wow, Papa, you're fancy. Yeah, I didn't think we could afford Maytag because Maytag is like the Mercedes Benz of washers and dryers. But is it? I don't day, know yeah, about Maytag. They're like hella famous. But um, when I got there, they actually had a sale on this specific unit and oh. it ended up costing the same as like a Samsung or LG. Wow, it's a 10 year warranty too. They even, they're so proud they even put it on the, on here. Yeah. So we're, we're like, they're, they're running one cycle. Yeah. I guess just to like get it through and get it through, but it's, it's big because it could wash like uh, all kinds of stuff in here. I like our laundry room. That's a good enough space. There's cabinets behind you and then like, uh, we could fold our clothes on top of that counter. Yeah. Pretty convenient, huh? Yeah, this is cool. Wow, great job, Papa. Thank you, Mama. I feel like we need to add something here now. We so can. It's weird, we, right? We can build little cabinets. Maybe, because, uh, yeah, like the way we had it, I don't know. I don't even know why we would need that, but. We could build a little cabinet. I mean, it's a laundry room. We don't really have to, right? Well, That's what this is for. But we're also not maximizing space. So True. I guess if we need to, we can just we get those. Option. uh those things and build it there. How cool! Great job, baby. This is great. Let's see how quiet it is. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's important. Because when they sold this place to us, they said the laundry room was going to be pretty quiet. Let's see. Oh, it's pretty good. I mean, you can hear it. I mean, you could definitely hear it. But if you have a TV on, it's not going to prevent you from falling see. asleep. That's true. Holy shit, that's not bad. Oh, well, considering there'll be clothes here. Yeah, and there's nothing. There's no furniture in here either. So it's just a big echoey house. Oh, there you go. There Shh, you. Let me hear it. Oh, you can hear it. Barely yeah. though. Barely. You just hear it sounds like a low rumble. You can still go to sleep. Yeah, it's nice. Not bad. I mean, yeah, it, if the baby sleeps here, it's not going to like wake it up. But you're definitely not losing sleep, that's for sure. What's with that, babe? Well, now it's time to get the CUNY bed set up. Just so that we can get a little taste of comfort. Before <laughs> it comes. You like my knife? It's fucking sick, huh? What kind of knife is that? It's a spider co, it's one of my favorite brands. The, uh, in, in the movie Training Day, Denzel Washington has a bigger version. He has the police one, and he's the one that's like, "I'm surgical with it." And he had the, uh, he pulls it out, and I think he cuts something. I forgot what he does. But this is a smaller version. I used to have that exact knife that's sleep. Woohoo! Woohoo! 
Pop Bear likes it because it has a cooling gel. Because I get freaking hot. But let's get the sheets on. Because we haven't felt the true comfort of it. Just because um, we have this plastic wrap. It doesn't really allow it to do its thing, thing. You know what I'm saying? Thing. <laughs> oh, it's so funny. You're so dumb. He's surgical with it. Watch the wall. Hey, hey, hey. I'm a pro. Well, at least it looks like I'm a pro, huh? Yeah. Everything you do looks like you're a pro. You got all this? Yeah. I like that we picked this bed together and we both decided 100%. We looked at each other and we were like, oh, yeah. Store, oh, yes. At the store, we were between this and tempur -Pedic, but then when we laid on it, we looked at each other. Well, because we like tempur -Pedic, but then we were like, but it's so hard still. It's like, it's soft, but then when you sink all the way down, then it feels like, wait, it's not going anywhere anymore. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Keep moving. <laughs> that make you happy. You make me extremely happy. I like how cute that little design on the bottom is. The little checkers. Yeah. It's like white and black but with checkers. You see? Woo shit. Oh, sorry. Okay. And this is what holds the entire bed together, these little nubs. There's no glue in between the layers. It's like a perfect square. Damn. Heirloom. Heirloom cut. Not a Francio, but heirloom. Ow. Oh, should you cut yourself? No. What this happened? is not a regular bed. This shit's heavy. I, I, I was used to using like regular bed string, but it's pretty heavy. Oh. Not for you. Oh, you see? This is what holds it together. Oh yeah, the little gussets. Nice. Can you pull that plastic over? Oh, it smells like glue. Huh? Can you pull that plastic over? Get out of here. Huh? You wanna play chicken? No. I lay right here and, and try to get out the last second. No! I want our baby to see. No, no! Ooh. <laughs> You're crazy. That's the difference, you know that's the difference between boys and girls? They're stupid? If we have a boy, <laughs> and that's girls the type are of not. stuff that boys does. Because girls are like, we gotta put it on. But guys are like, let's get out of this motherfucker. And then if we have two boys, they start ooh, ooh, slap, slapping each other's head on the mattress. <laughs> you don't need two boys. I think you just had enough fun for two boys. Damn. Holy shit. Come on. <laughs> you keep lying. My turn. Hey, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Fine, fine, fine. Just wash these today too. Mmm, smells good. Delicious. We have to sleep on the floor until our bed frame comes in, which is not until... Like in two days or something? Three days. Three days? Oh, that smells really good. You smell it? No. You don't smell it? I yes, I smell a lot of the glue. Don't you got the glue the, overpowers... The pregnancy senses? Yeah, the glue overpowers the... The detergent. How pleasant. Oh, is that the washer sound? Yeah. Cool. Once you buy the right detergent, you can wash this and push that on. Let me put that on. Gotta make a trip out to Koskizi. We gotta get that high efficiency kind of. Damn, fits like a glove. This is a great color, Papa. You promise? Yeah. Cause you said the other one was freaking ugly. It was tacky. For, for our decor. It doesn't fit our theme. Let me see, hold on. Ah, you beat me. Ah, ah, just kidding. 
Is that it? You're done? You good on it? Hell yeah, I am. <laughs> you a little relaxed. You've been laying on it all day. Oh, shit. Oh my god. And it's not even broken in yet. I they know. said it's going to be really broken in after 30 days. A month, yeah. I'm, I'm not. <sighs> oh, all of a sudden. Oh my god. What did we do to deserve this? Nothing. Mm. Feels so nice. And this area is so quiet. Oh my god, this is awesome. Thank you, Papa. Good night. <laughs> Alright guys, we got all of the major stuff in. Now we just gotta put away all the little knickknacks. And I don't wanna bore you guys. God damn it. So I don't wanna bore you guys with all these putting like individual things like this away. So um I'm gonna call it a day with the vlog here. But know that we are very, very happy and we are very happy that we're able to share this much of the journey with you guys. Stay tuned as the house keeps getting built out. I know, it's such an exciting time for us all. I thought you were sleeping. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah.